Might be pretty nice. Play with pencils, paper, and dice. Left off last time, you had a spearheaded character. Char I had a uh, maze on, or it's Carter. Carter. Yeah, you had spearheaded Carter, Carter through a uh, plate glass door. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yelling up all right. It's all good. <laughs> he wasn't even really hurt. Just, you know, gave him some of that uh, that magic zap that, uh, you know, what's his face with, with, the, with the nose over here does. And it yeah, brims. Yeah, that guy, the coffee guy. He's the coffee guy? Yeah, brim, full of the brim. Oh, uh, yeah, that old yeah. Uh, TV trope. Yeah, yeah, man. People still say brim. Yeah, it's, it's a thing. Look it up in the damn dictionary. Uh, we, yep, yep, it's still there. <laughs> you with your cyber. So there's a... Uh, Sinless bastard. Ching, ching. <laughs> Some of us do it the old fashioned way. <laughs> <laughs> yes, old fashioned way. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> hey, who's this guy? Oh, I'm not there yet. <laughs> <laughs> you have a name yet, Ryan? Um, Dutch. Dutch? Yes. Hey, so uh, I got a call from uh, Dutch. You remember him? That rigger, we used a couple, uh, two or three times. Oh, the guy with the remote control cars. Yeah, all right, he seemed okay. Why? Oh, uh, he was just looking for some work, and you know, we could. Uh, not that I'm questioning your driving abilities, but we could use a better one. Oh, oh, oh come on, man! Look, I, I had one incident. All right, coming in hot. You know how many needles how many hey. I had the thread. Just to get us to that point, we all walked away from that. I, I know how many plate glass windows I flew through. Yeah, quite quite frankly, that that is that is one of the least dramatic accidents you've had. That that, that fact notwithstanding, that's it's still it's still the case. And just to set the scene, you guys are walking back from the hospital, which is about seven to eight blocks away from your place. Because you can't drive back because somebody totaled the car. Yeah, whatever. Or yeah, technically, I could uh, I could call my guy Jackie, but uh, I don't want to admit. Your phone was damaged in the accident. You broke the screen. Son of a bitch! <laughs> Got the insurance on that. You want me to call him? You know what? Fine. It's all in my head. <laughs> okay. Jackie, come pick us up. We're by the uh, by the Triangle K. No question. I'm just do it. He says, "Me, your boss, in the background." He Wait, heard none of that. You got a proper <laughs> microphone? Is that going to work? <laughs> yeah, he, he, he got all of it. <coughs> yeah. Let me see your phone. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, boy. Got some extra corners now. You cut me a little. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can take it to the shop and fix it. Sweet. I didn't really feel like ponying up the dough for, for a fresh one. I'll wait for the next model to come out. This thing's still yeah, car. yeah, yeah. A few minutes later, the car pulls up. Jackie gets out, goes to the trunk, pulls out a box, opens it up, throws the packaging back in the box, and hands you another phone. Oh, yeah, hey, thanks. <laughs> right, I got the crate of these phones. You know, when, when you're buying a case pack, it is important to remember, you know, I don't need to explain myself to you. Let's no, go. You don't. <laughs> no. don't forget to activate the damn thing. Jackie swapped this in. No. It's really, 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 really easy. You just you know, it's well, wait, it's pop, pop. Just, just give it a quick. Yeah. So, we go back to your place. We got paid, right? Yeah, the dude even went, went straight into the accounts. It's yeah, always all wired and right. Yeah, that was confirmed. Okay. Yeah. Yep, see it on my new phone. <laughs> you transferred the money into the accounts? 
Yeah. Because it was sent to you. Yeah. <laughs> he did say. He did say. He broke it down per person and everything. Yeah. It was, right. so it just, yeah, like 3,000 or something, something like that. Yeah, it was 3,000. Yeah, 3, and I was like, yay, I get to live for another month in my lap of luxury. Now you get to live for 10 days in that ledger. I said nothing to you. <laughs> anyway. Oh. Oh, where did all my money go? I bought several cyber decks. Those things are expensive. I did not mean to buy several cyber decks. I just pushed a button and suddenly I have three cyber decks. Think. Oops. Now, I know this one's way worse and in all ways, shapes, and forms not as good as the other two I've got, but I'm going to keep all three of them. I use this one as a coaster. You use your left foot as a coaster? All right. Uh, so. Okay. So we get a... Jackie stands there by uh -huh. the car waiting for you guys to get in. I get in. Yeah. I wait. Yeah. In. Hop in. Okay. Drive Actually, back I, look to in, the I look in the back of the bar. There's strength. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a drop down now, set a console. Excellent. It's, I think uh, a night like this calls for, for some bourbon, you know, some something a little bit strong. Uh, it's, it's about 8, 10 a.m. on Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> 80 years old. <laughs> 80 years old uh, and uh, probably about 180 proof. So, Don't smoke when you drink this. <laughs> no problem, boss. I topped it off with a cheap shit for you, like always. <laughs> you know, you don't need to advertise that. No, if no. I was entertaining a client back here. No, you don't need to advertise, Jackie. Not at all. Well, when I'm when I'm when, when there's four of us drinking, okay, I, maybe I gotta cut some corners. What? Well, I'm just gonna take a nap. <laughs> it's like this. <laughs> if you just let us drink it without talking about it, nobody would have noticed. <clears throat> but you're gonna talk about how great it is, and we're gonna taste it. It's my thing. It's what I do. <laughs> what city are we in? Seattle. This guy's unconscious again. Hmm. He was trying to sleep before. It's true, I'm just wondering, you know. We're trying to get him to fall turn. asleep. You're trying to get him to sharp, fall asleep. To come up on a sharp ten, now. <laughs> Not a problem, I strapped him out. <laughs> I uh, that's him kind out. of the opposite, but okay. <laughs> We're on our way back? Yeah, yeah, we pull into the parking garage. Okay. Parked under the building. Pulls up next to the door to let you guys out. Over by the elevator. Okay. So, should we just let him sleep it off in the car? Or do we bring him upstairs? Yeah, but I would prefer if he wasn't in my car when well, I'm not in my car. Hmm? All right. And then I unstrap him and. Grab him by the belt. All right, let's go. <laughs> How much you weigh? Nice. Uh, myself. Uh, 112k. What's your strength? Um, nine. Almost as strong as I can be. Mm. You got two to help. Nine? Yeah. Wow. He's a troll. He's a troll. Yeah. <laughs> My strength is two. Uh, yeah. I may, I, I'm, uh, let's see here. And you're just dead, My, right? Uh, okay. Oh, right. It, since I've already started advancing. I can't look that up. I'm pretty sure I had uh, my stats as an A priority. I think you yeah. had to to get the numbers you have. Okay. And he grabs him by the belt buckle. And yeah. Puppets him up the stairs, kicking his legs. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> nice oh. Look at me! I used to play, play pro ball, but now I'm a pitiful schnook! <laughs> <laughs> Let the man sleep. You were telling me about it. We hadn't slept. He doesn't wake up! <laughs> Let him sleep. I'll let him sleep when we get upstairs. An expensive couch. He drools. Put a <laughs> towel under his head. Let him sleep on the floor. He's, there's already a drool spot. <laughs> I'm just going to put his head in the same damn spot. <laughs> same you got people for that. Spot. You got people for that drool spot, don't you? At a class place like this. I got Jackie. The doorman won't come in no more. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, 
ain't right. <clears throat> there was a minor cleanup. May have been some police, you know. Anyway. Other things. You don't want a policeman to be ODing in your apartment. I'm just saying. What, nobody? Just me? Just you. <laughs> what time of year is it? Oh. Midsummer. Okay, well, I gotta make a phone call. Make a phone call. Get 350 million bets on uh, baseball teams. Okay. You're gambling too? The way I play it is not gambling. Uh, speaking of the character, but okay. What's your addiction? Moderate camera. It's got two of those. Well, now we know how you two know. knowledge of sports. This could be fun. Sleeping. Sorry. Right. Yeah, you mentioned everybody else. And I did. Okay. When we get back there, I say, okay. So, when's this motor mouth gonna? This motor mouth fixer here is gonna have some work for us. That is a great question. And he said he was going to give me a call within 24 hours. And uh, how long has it been? Got a couple hours left. He ain't been 24 hours yet. So he, he's not. Right. Uh, he's not late. Well, we are, then why don't we call Dutch to see if Dutch gets over here so that he can say whether he wants in or out. I guess, I mean, uh, my man, uh, you know, with the drool stain on his face, he, he's supposed to be the one making contact, but uh, since Carter's out, yeah, whatever. Uh, we we'll call Dutch. Yeah. Break him my new phone. Oh, hey, ring, ring. Just like the old uh, phone. Yes. Hey, that's man. Hey, well, how's it going, man? This is Bobo. Oh, hey, Bobo. What's going on? Oh, I'm doing great, man. I'm so glad to hear your voice. You know, it's, it seems like it's been an eternity. Now, look, uh, Carter said that you might be interested in a little bit of work. Unfortunately, he is completely unconscious, ruining my couch. So, uh, you know, if you wanted to uh, discuss it, we, we could do so over some uh, expensive bourbon over here at my place. Well, that sounds good. I'll be over in a bit. Glad you think so. See you in a few. Uh, uh, see, which vehicle do I use? And now we know why he needs money. Oh, God. All his vehicles. <laughs> I've got some fun vehicles, too. The regular ones and the entertaining ones. Um, but I take one of the regular ones, so I get in my, I get in my van that totally looks normal. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, so you get in your A-team van. Hey. <laughs> you want to let, you wanna let the doorman and Jackie know so that they can let him in without giving them any grief? Yeah, son of a bitch. Oh, I found it. <laughs> go, <laughs> go out. <laughs> Jackie! Hey! Yeah, guy, guy coming. Name it Dutch. All right? Call he's the guy with the toys. He's cool. Uh, yeah, he's, he's got a, the, what do you call it, a remote control uh, thing going on. I, I don't know. Oh, I like him. He comes over and stays at your place when you're out. Oh, that's you know. horrifying. All right, well, he's coming. <laughs> and get the, let the doorman know he's on his way, too, unless, of course, he lets him in when I'm not... Yeah, just, uh, yeah, yeah but you're here, so you better let him go. <laughs> fuck you, guy. Jesus. <laughs> can't believe this. What, what's oh, the doorman's name again before? real fast? Right. I have contacts left over. Um, well, Jackie, Jackie is my, like, manservant or whatever, assistant, whatever the hell. All right, right. your PA. Do, do we name the doorman? No, I didn't. Okay, so Jackie is one of my contacts. Uh, you have contacts left over? Uh, I am out of them now. I have one point left. So, Jackie's not a great friend, but I do know him. Who, what are your other contacts? Uh, I have a dock worker who works at a dock that receives um, cars. Dock worker that, res that works at a dock? Wow. Mm -hmm. well, uh, dock workers who that work at a warehouse. Yeah, they work. Yeah. 
Jackie the doorman and an auto mechanic. Well, Jackie's not a doorman. He's my, or, my, you're, my yeah, his manservant, but I know him. I'm trying to see what I can do. Put him in as. We'll call him a corporate wage slave. <laughs> I get nothing else for him. Personal assistant. They don't have. Do they have personal assistant? That's not your personal assistant. No, but do they have person? No, they don't have personal assistant. I could probably type it in. What is a contact? Yeah. There you go. Personal assistant. I'm good. Yeah, just custom, whatever. Yeah, that's it. Just do a custom. There you go. Okay. I don't know. I have several low-ranking contacts. I don't have any real impressive contacts, but I, I know people to talk to. No one owes me any great favors. I was going to say I have a couple uh, storyline contacts. I could probably... Let's start here. Bartender. Throw me a storyline contact. I can ditch my dock worker. He was just... My, I decided my secondary racket was stealing cars. But I don't need to have that. Because originally I was going to make him more like Vin Diesel, but I don't have enough points to dump into strength for Vin Diesel. <laughs> God, I hate those movies. They're not there to be loved. They're who's there to be ridiculous. Who's who's got the bartender and what's his name? Okay, I don't know. I I thought you named him. No, I didn't have a name for him. Uh, or contacts in this again. Social. Oh, if you have the drummer thing, I don't know. Louis the bartender. Louis. Yeah. Louis, Louis, Louis. Oh yeah, I was writing all those down. Seattle Atlantean Foundation. Bartender yep. is. Louis. Arch type. Okay. Okay. Who, what was the name of the fixer? Uh, the Con one you guys are contacting. Okay. Moreau. Uh, All right. Yeah. Who's he knows me. I don't have any. I'm not any really impressed, but or he is not really impressed by me. Is there someone had a smuggler? No. Uh, well, I got a smuggler on here, but we don't have a name for him. It's so not like a good name him. I have a mafia consigliere. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> there was a second <laughs> fixer. It was a, a I have a second fixer. I don't have any. Uh, you had uh, McAllister. Okay. If, if Jackie were the consigliere, he wouldn't be hanging out with me so much. <laughs> no, he's an indentured male servant. <laughs> he can leave any time he wants his credit rating ruined. All right. <laughs> I tend to hang out with gamblers because you can, you know, really put the screws to them if it comes down to it. Uh, he he owed somebody something in the wrong way. Someone have a club hopper. I did. Name? No idea. Not yet. Miffy. Sure. <laughs> Miffy. <laughs> Goes by name Chris. My, my B cop name. The B cop's name is O'Shaughnessy. O'Shaughnessy. Mm -hmm. Oh, so I see. An I Irish stereotype cop. Okay. Do my I name want to buy a helicopter? It's the only real question in my Fred. life still. Okay. Well, I don't know, man. Those whirly birds are just they ain't right. <laughs> oh, again with that <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> you know, follow us from system to system. That's the one thing I can't fix. <laughs> that means I hate them. <laughs> oh, is that what it was? Okay. Yeah. Right out of skill points. Okay, so. All right, that's back at my fortress. You show up in your 18 van. Yeah. With little to no issues. Paul Fondler's van. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have. It is a. What is it? Bulldog Step Van. Yep. GMC. <laughs> Did you get that? I've watched all of Rick and Morty like three so, times now. It's so good. They're not. The episodes aren't coming out fast enough. So you show up, pull up to the parking garage. It opens. You pull in. Mm-hmm. I drive in, park, in my usual spot. Okay. Use your guest pass key that you had, uh, that Jackie had given you to right. enter the elevator. Finally, <laughs> 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 makes the best of the door. <laughs> Go your pass key. <laughs> <laughs> it opens up. Walk to the kitchen, get one of his beers. Walk back over. Come on! In front of you. At least pretend. Hey, I've been watering your petunias, but they don't look like you've been doing a good job on them. 
Take them with you when you go. <laughs> oh, thanks. I didn't. Mm. Mm. What's a shock pad? He added an accessory on a weapon. Uh, reduces mm. recoil. Yeah. Mm. I almost, I almost said something about tasers because there's a lot of electroshock weapons. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I mean, I have, I have two, <laughs> basically. Just like, ah, I guess I could. Yeah, there's no. Mm, that's cool. <laughs> Got my surprise glove. Uh, That's one thing my 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 character is always like putting on white gloves to do stuff. It doesn't. Uh, and one of them is actually got an oh. electroshock weapon attached to it. Oh. Oh. Well, right here. Why I'm am I not surprised that. that your character has a happy? Bus. Well, I mean, that's probably not the core book. Hey, what are you trying to say? Hey. Yeah. Almost. I'm approaching uh, Andrew Dice Clay levels of obnoxious. I think. You're, uh, and I don't know that I want to tell it on a town at all. Your car, your com link starts ringing. Oh, thank God! Trip, 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 trip. Tri com, uh, we have com links. I thought it was all PDAs here. Well, yours is a cell phone. That's right. Yeah. Talk to me. Hey, it's Moreau. He says, "Well, uh, hey, good news and bad news." All right. Uh, well, then, thanks for calling. Uh, what, 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 what's the news? Well, I've got a good. I, I've got a. I've got a few things I got to take care of personally. So I'm gonna hand this meat off. Uh, so you should be hearing from somebody here about noon. Oh, uh, all right. So uh, there's gonna be a different, different, uh, different guy. Oh, okay. Uh, this is this is normal. I mean, mm -hmm. they you contact your fixer. They set it up with somebody. That person right. meets with you because they're the one with the money. Okay. Well, you got a name for me? Um, I believe you said his name was McAllister. McAllister, okay, I'll uh, keep my ear to the ground for a call from uh, Mr. Mr. McAllister. All right, thanks, Moreau. Uh, hey, Where hey, will you know, meet? If, hmm? He'll be contacting you guys. Okay. You know, if you need any assistance with uh, you know, the matters that you're dealing with right now, remember, I'm only a phone call away. Oh, I got people for that. <laughs> I know, I know, but you know, you know me, I'm helpful. It's great. It, it, it just, uh, thanks so much for calling. Yeah, I love you, man. You take care. Yep. <laughs> what? I'm helpful. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm helpful by beating the shit out of people while I talk to them. And they would rather I stop the talking before I stop the beating. <laughs> that is also true. If they were going to choose an order between the two. Anyway. You're, uh, you're chilling on the couch watching the game on, on TV. So well, we, uh, it's too early. It's, the game hasn't started yet, has it? So it's it's simulcast. Oh, we got uh, we got maybe uh, two hours before we're hearing from. Uh, uh, no, he called it about eleven thirty. Oh, really? Okay, we said ten before. I didn't think of much time then. He's been sleeping. Okay. You contacted him. He drove over. That's casually, true. You know. Okay, so uh, anytime now we're gonna be getting a call. So can from I make? A, yeah, well, with, since you're you, you're, ask, you're asking people to ask, is it alright if I make myself a sandwich? You know what? Knock yourself out. Mm -hmm. Thanks. If you're going to knock yourself out, that big gun cut salami and that'd be perfect. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, right on part about noon, the, uh, the, you get the chirp on the TV since they know you're home. <laughs> oh, all right. Uh, the, the com link popping up on the TV. It's a big matrix icon, uh, uh, resembling the traditional smiley face, mm -hmm. uh, only the uh, has a it's red with a crooked smile. The smile's crooked to one side, with a little jagged line resembling a tusk hanging out of the mouth. Lovely. Okay. Well, you know, and connect. It's got the answering thing on it. You know, so. <laughs> connect. I just do. I use my PDA yep. to do that. Uh, the icon's replaced with a grinning male orc. His uh, face lined with age. His hair and goatee with a touch of gray with a pair of golden data jacks gleaming along the left, uh, his left temple. Mm. Uh, wire frimmed glasses set, a, set among his nose. And not like, you know, goggles or anything, mm. just traditional wired frame reading glasses. Gotcha. McAllister, I presume. Hey, thanks for calling. Hey, chummers. York says with a cheerful grin. Hey, I hear Mac? you might be interested in a bit of biz. Hey, Mac. Hey, how's it going? Good. <laughs> You betcha, hey, we're here to serve. Just, just wake him up. Wake wake him up. <laughs> <laughs> just click the link to him. 
Well, if you guys are interested, head on over to <laughs> Underground <laughs> 90s <laughs> to 97. <laughs> What's all that noise over there? Uh, not nothing? Well, yeah, guy well, uh, yeah, mm. uh, Stand up and go over to the kitchen and get a towel. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a small concert going on. Uh, let the doorman know you're here to meet McAllister and he'll let you in. We'll do Underground 97. We, we, we will be there. We will be there early. I thank you so much. Uh, get yourself some good seats. Uh, after the show, we'll have a chat and uh, tell you a bit more if you're interested. Okay. Absolutely. We'll be there with bells on. All righty. Bells? Bells on? Don't oh, criticize game. my style. Mm. All right. Currently, your team's losing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like showing you my balcony. <laughs> Don't let him show you your balcony. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Bell. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be bastard. <laughs> see all the stuff. We've already, we've already established uh, through basically retrospectives that I have thrown him off my balcony after getting pissed off enough, and he <laughs> basically came back upstairs. <laughs> came back upstairs to lay down and sleep it off. Yeah. Ow, I'm going to lay down. What? No! Because <laughs> he's got ridiculous armor.